Sunday is Li Dong on the lunar calendar, which marks the start of winter. And as if on cue, an exceptionally strong cold air mass will hit northern Taiwan tomorrow. The Central Weather Bureau says Monday's weather will, for northern Taiwan will be the complete opposite of Sundays as cold air ushers in low temperatures and wet weather. The moisture will dissipate on Wednesday, leaving the island drier but still cold. Temperatures in open areas along the northern coast will dip to 12 degrees under the effects of radiative cooling. The sun shone brightly early Sunday morning, bringing people out of their homes to bask in it. Some practiced Tai Chi while others took in the sights. The balmy weather won't last, though, as Sunday night will usher in drastically different weather. Zheng Mingdian, the head of the Central Weather Bureau, posted on Facebook that a cold air mass, which has already plunged temperatures in Xinjiang, is approaching. In front of it is a large low-pressure system, whose front is expected to arrive Taiwan overnight. The main front will arrive Sunday night, and the temperature change will be rapid. Due to the rapid speed of the cold air mass's approach, starting in the early hours of tomorrow, temperatures will drop noticeably as if going down a slide. We expect the highs in northern Taiwan between today and tomorrow to drop by about 10 degrees. As the cold air approaches, rain is also coming in from southern China. On Monday and Tuesday, northern and eastern regions will see brief showers with daytime temperatures hovering between 16 and 20 degrees. Wet and cold will be the order of the day. Copious precipitation could lead to rime and sleet in alpine regions, even snow. Central and southern regions will be mostly fair with highs reaching 28 degrees. However, from Wednesday to Friday, weather for the whole island will turn to being dry and cold. Radiative cooling might see the mercury drop to 16 degrees in central and southern regions and 14 degrees or less in northern and eastern regions. Open areas along the coast may even see 12 degrees. Whether this cold air mass will be the first continental cold air mass of the winter season remains to be seen. This wave of cold air will keep its intensity. It's expected to be the strongest cold air of this fall season so far, and there is a good chance it will be. It won't let up until after Saturday when the cold air's intensity gradually reduces. Temperatures will rise noticeably after Saturday. On Monday, the temperature will plunge by as much as 10 degrees in the north. The public is reminded to bundle up and bring an umbrella.